Hello and welcome to Not Our Gamer Gaming. This is Genesis with episode 8 of Subnautica. Alright, so a little bit of time has passed since I've last played, at least a couple days. Uh, you guys have been watching them, uh, giving some good advice in the comments, and I've also been kind of messing around with a little, a little bit of a side game just to get some of the finer points of uh, the plane to, to get this stuff figured out. And yeah, I think I have a little bit more of an idea what to do now. All right, so first off, uh, let's go ahead and take a look at things that we've gathered or unlocked since uh, our last trip to um, the Aurora. Now, we've learned the propulsion cannon. I think we learned the stasis rifle back on the on the island, and we, we haven't crafted any of those things. But I think I'd at least like to get the propulsion cannon, because that sounds handy. So wiring kit, battery, and titanium. Okay, so uh, titanium, yep. Uh, let's see, now for the... Um, Oh, what was that? The, uh, hold on. Battery. Yeah, we got what those. Actually, I'll take one of these guys. Unless I have a, an empty one here somewhere. Uh, locker. Oh, this is where I'm keeping the batteries. So, I want to grab a 0% one. Those are all charged. There's one, there's a couple that are charging right here. I'll grab this guy right here. Cool. Alright, let's uh, double check that. Uh, personal tools. Um, battery titanium wiring kit. Okay. I think that takes silver? Uh, let's see. I, I don't really need to label these things. Uh, that's uh, lithium, lead, magnesite. Do we not have silver? Um, let's double check everything. Miscellaneous? Maybe, maybe not. Oh, I really need to get organized. Um, oh, gold, silver. Here we go. Silver, silver. Fantastic. So use a fabricator and wiring kit. All right, so that should allow us to create a propulsion cannon. Let's try that. Look at this. Propulsion cannon. Ooh. Got like a portal gun thing going on here. Let's take a look at this. Ooh. <laughs> cool. All right, we're going to have fun with that. All right, so uh, do we have any uh, current objectives? So let me just kind of get caught up here because it's all been kind of a, a mishmash of things here. Um, b -b -b faint black box signature set. That's all the Aurora stuff. Life Pod 4. We don't have any active beacons. Okay, so let's go ahead and listen to a radio and see what it has to say. This is an automated distress signal for Life Pod 12. Coordinates attack. Warning, Life Pod has sunk beyond safe diving distance. Do not attempt retrieval without submersible support. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Okay, well, that voice was really struggling. Uh, you think if enough advanced technology, they would be a little better at their... Uh, their voices. Okay, that is 250 meters down. And that's 40, almost 1,400 meters away. Wow. All right, so let's take a look at our Seamoth. Now, we actually got a couple of these modules, a storage module and a depth module, uh, since uh, over at the, uh, we call it the place there. Um, now, let's see. Hold on, Seamoth. Uh, blueprints, vehicles, Seamoth. Uh, what's the, the default is 200 meters. So how much was that again? Was it 150? 250. Ooh, okay, that's too much. However, we can fix that. Let's take the uh, storage module, put it here, and the depth module. Now 300 meters. So now the Seamoth is capable of diving all the way down to uh, that new location. So that's really convenient. Okay, I'm going to do a little bit of inventory sorting and uh, wait for the daytime. Because I'd rather not <laughs> head out this time of night and head in that direction. All right, I think we're about to good to go. Uh, one last thing. Uh, there was something I mentioned in the comments that I need to confirm. They said uh, salt, and I think it was, hold on, um, some one of the corals. Uh, not, was it table coral? No, it wasn't table coral. Hold on, let's go up and take a quick look. Yeah, it was off of one of these. Uh, coral tube. Okay, so we take, uh, take that and some salt. Hit over here. And then fabricator, and that makes bleach. And I never thought really thought to look into what that does. Yeah, this. So this makes the better water, but two of them. So gathering a little bit of salt and a little bit of that coral stuff is way easier than swimming around grabbing those little little dickheads there. Uh, do I have? Hold on. What do we need for more bleach? Another salt deposit. Pretty sure I have another one. Yes. So we need to grab more salt. Really, that's. Uh, to get some of the good water? Absolutely. There we go. And then into the good disinfected water. Awesome. So we're going to be ready for that. Okay, so I think we're about ready to go. Our Seamoth has been upgraded. 
There's our, you know, modifications. Now we have a storage module right over here, and we can put some extra water in. And I don't think I'll need my habitat hmm, builder. I'll keep that in here. Um, sea glide, I'll keep that on me. Number five, put this in number four. A power cell, which could be handy, I'll keep it in here. I'll grab an extra battery, and I think we'll be good to go. Battery. Um, gosh, again, turn around my own base here. Batteries. Oh, get it, get out of there. And yes, battery. I'll grab a couple of batteries. Cool. I think we are good to go. Let's hop into our little sea moth here. Actually, let me uh, toss one battery in here. Yoink. Okay, so we have a destination. Here we go. All right. Whoa. So 1,300 and some meters that way. All right. So which direction is that? Uh, oh my. That's uh, past the crash site. Ooh, this is this is going to be dangerous territory. I can tell. Um, hmm. Okay, this will this will be something. Right, we're entering wherever the hell this is. Whoa! Okay, that does not look friendly. Ooh, neither does that. Okay, we know to stay away the hell from where away from that. This looks interesting. Okay, let's uh, stop here for a quick second. Now, something I've been told is scan everything, and I, I haven't done that enough. Common bulb bush. bush. So I want to scan everything and check to see if it has any usement. Edible in small quantities. Ooh, okay. Um, can I have some? Is that edible? Uh, yeah. Food three, water two. Oh, nice. Oh no, that's not what I needed. Grab some of that. Cool. Uh, that'll help hydrate us and stuff. So let's uh, munch it down. Wow, that actually really topped us up. <laughs> that's handy. Hell, I should have a base out here. We'd never go hungry. Where was it going? Oh yes, this way. All right, so the electric eels. Ah, oh, this place looks messed up. There's the pod. Volcanic activity and several unusual electromagnetic signatures in the region. No Exercise shit, eh? Caution when diving deeper. Yeah, yeah, I'd say there's a lot of uh, a lot of jerks around here. I wonder how good this propulsion cannon thing is. Guess we'll have to find out. All right, life pod twelve. Ooh, okay. Okay, let's just get in here. Okay, we got a PDA. Okay, let's play that. New PDA data. I'm uh, not really a doctor. I know that's what my ID says, but I never have been. Cheated the medical exams. What does a doctor these days need to know about manually resetting bones? When was the last time a top surgeon actually cut someone open? That's what the robots are for. Doctors these days read diagnoses off of computer readouts. For that, I'm perfectly qualified. But what good is it when I'm not connected to the main network? I'm bleeding. I've got glowing green pustules growing on my hands. I run a self-scan and it tells me I've got skin irritation. The only thing I studied in medical school was how to lie convincingly. What the hell do I know about how to treat an alien disease? I think I'm actually going to die down here. That guy sounds like in rough shape. Oh, uh, new battery. Yeah, having a repair tool is probably a good idea. Okay, um, whoa. Hello. You stay way the hell away from me. Okay, so can I go in there without any damage? Whoa, oh, not friendly. Not friendly. Uh, whoa. Okay, ow, that took a chunk. Okay, let's uh, get a bit of let's get a bit of space here. And get a bit of space. I need to find out if this propulsion cannon thing can do any. Uh... No, do nothing. What does it do? Uh, warp square to pull and push objects. So is it not like a? It's not like an attack thing. Okay, all right. Duly noted. Actually, let me see if I can fix this quickly because uh, that took a bit of damage. Oh, there we go. 
Okay, so proceed carefully. Can you stay still? Is there anything else here I could be looking for? Um, I mean, there's a lot of valuable minerals around. Maybe I should check through. Is there any caves? Uh, oh, there's definitely a cave. But... Oh, I don't know about that. <laughs> I don't know about that. Okay, let's get away from Chompy over here and take a look around. Alright, there seems to be a crash site over here. Whoa! Did he just zip up there? Alright, that's fine. Ooh, I see uh, something glowing down there. Can we get closer without becoming... Oh, God. Oh, maybe, maybe I should have made the rifle instead. For sure the stasis rifle might have had... Oh, okay, this is... How do I fight against those things? Um, I don't think we're prepared for that. But I, think, I see things I want to look at and scan. All right, let's try to get a little closer. A little closer. Okay, all right, let's get out there. Go, 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 go. What is that? Uh, nothing? That's nothing. Oh! Oh, boy, kids. I think I'd rather be bitten in here than be bit out there. Pretty sure that would hurt less. Okay, so what's going on over here? All kinds of bullcrap. Yeah, see that? I want that. It's like a data thing. Okay, let's go, go for it. I'm going for it. D uh, data box. What is it? What is it? Alien containment? Ooh. What does that do? Uh, units must be installed for multi-purpose rooms. Connect to the rooms to stack a column. Hatch must be installed to access the unit. Is it planter, seafloor, to grow from seed? Okay, so it's... Um, okay, you can grow alien life forms in it. Uh, this design... Okay, it's designed primarily to breed larger or more dangerous species. So what, is, what does that do? What does growing them do? Oh. Whoa! God damn it. Oh, there's a hatch. Can I get in there? Okay, this uh, this place this place is making me nervy. A little nervous. All right, looks like there's stuff in there. Okay, I'm going. I'm going for it. I'm going. I'm going in. Going in. Okay. Whew. Okay. Where's our friggin' uh, Hopefully the um, uh, what are the th hold on? Let's we've got some things mixed around here. That's a number four. All right. Lights. Okay, hopefully no one comes in here. Modification. Ooh, modification station. Okay, that's some of that. Ooh, we get, the, we get a modification station. Cool. Supply crate with disinfected water. And then more water. And what about this thing? That's uh, the module station, looks like. Anything else in here before I... Uh, Make a break for it. I mean, that was good. So, I'm not complaining. Okay. Alright, let's make a run for it. Where's my thing? There we go. Let's get out of here. Okay, looks like a few other things to scan down here. Oh, sorry guys. Alright, go for it. That's a... Nothing? 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 Okay, nothing to scan here. Alright. I still want to miss anything. I feel like I, I miss a lot of things. Because I'm always in a rush. I'm always talking while I'm playing. Being all distracted and stuff. Okay, some salt. I already got that. Those boxes don't seem to have anything. That's, that's just a door. Whoa! Ow! That's a big chunk of our, our damage. Okay, no. No. Okay, you know what? I think we're good. I think we're good. Let's get some space so I can get this fixed and take a one last look around. Alright, there seems to be a little cave here. I don't know if it's an actual cave or if it's just... Oh, okay, it might just be a little... Oh, I don't know what this is. Probably nothing to worry about. But I see something I can scan. What is this? Spotted dock leaf. Okay. Uh, it is... Okay, it's just a... Nothing to worry about. Uh, I probably should... Hold on. Oh! Um, huh. Okay, well, I didn't mean to do that, but all right. Uh, let's get our light out. 
Still have use of her flashlight. There we go. It's a little bit of ore. Lead. Why not? Since I'm here. All right. So I don't. Yeah, I think this is just a little sub cave. Like nothing. Nothing too extravagant. Let's uh, take one last, one more, one more look around. I'm afraid to leave, really. Oh, I think I might see something down here. Oh, never mind. I was already here. Oh yes, that wreckage. <laughs> never mind. All right, I think I'm ready to leave. Uh, I looked around. I didn't see anything else. I mean, I'm trying to keep out for caves and stuff like that. But ooh, there's some shale, shale down there. Is anyone around? Oh, you're around. Um, are you gonna... Yeah, you are. Okay, never mind. Alright, I can do without that. Alright, I, th I think I'm ready to get the hell out of here. Uh, I'm not sure if there's anything I'm missing. I'm gonna feel... Ooh. Yeah, I don't know, but going in there. Alright, let's get out of here. I think we've done enough for today. Let's go... Where am I going? Uh, yikes! Yeah, I need, I need to upgrade this damn ship. <laughs> Where's my base? There's my base. All right, I'm just uh, going through. I'm going to set my base to have like a red icon so I can follow it more easily. Yeah, there we go. That's a little easier. All right, what is in this? What is that? That is a huge mountainous area. Yeah, I got to explore more. Wait, what is that? That doesn't look... What is this? Oh, uh, that's not a good color. Nope, nope. Oh, it's the ship. It's Altera. Altera, Altera, but the, uh... Oh, no, get away from this. Uh, do we have my radiation suit on me? I don't. Okay. Move, move away. Move away. All right, I'm going to call that a semi-successful mission. We got to the pod. We didn't die. Got a little bit of resources, but, um... We got our asses handed to us. Just a little bit. Uh, is this our... Yeah, here it is. Okay, so let's uh, go ahead and, uh... Dock in the moon pool. Ow! Yeah, I probably need to fix this thing. Next chance I get. Okay, so we got a new thing. We got a, a modification station. I think that's a habitat kind of thing, isn't it? Um, oh, it's uh, in here. Oh, oh, fell right through it. That's that's not how physics works. All right, here we go. Okay, so yes, um, storage. So we have our habitat builder there. Maybe take a little bit of sip of water while we're at it. Yeah, we're not quite ready to eat. Okay, so yes, the habitat thing. That's number four. Here we go. And yes, modification station for modification of survival equipment. Computer chip, titanium, diamond, and lead. I think we can manage that. I'm not sure we had diamond, but I guess we don't. That's unfortunate. Well, let's, let's listen to the next radio message. Aurora, we're approaching the planet now. We have a landing site for you that's... Well, it's better than the alternatives. We've sent you the coordinates. It'll take us a couple of days to align our orbit. Should be able to establish direct contact with you during that time. Then we're coming in to get you. Cross your fingers, the weather holds. And don't leave us waiting. Sunbeam out. Okay, I guess it looks like we're getting rescued. That's good, right? Sunbeam will arrive at th in uh, 40 minutes. So do we have... Oh, look at that. Oh, that's life pod 12. Hold on. Take a look at my uh, beacon manager here. Oh, there we go. Aurora rendezvous point. Dry land. Okay. That's that's good, right? Okay, that's 13, 1,100 meters that way. Okay, all right. So I guess I'm going to prepare myself here. Now, can we create... Um, hold on. Let's go look over here for a second. No, I thought sure there was... Um, no, I guess we don't. I was trying to see if there's some way I can improve the... Uh, the, the um, no, no, I don't think there's any modifications I can I can do here. Crap. Let's double check something here. Uh, modification station. I thought that was for the vehicles. Survival equipment. No, it's just for, for myself. Alright. So I guess yeah, we have nothing better to do than head over to that rendezvous point. Alright, let's start. Yeah, let's head over there. Ow! Jeez Louise. That thing almost killed me. Okay, let's repair the Seamoth, first of all. And then repair myself. Oh, maybe I'll grab another, another health kit. All right, well, we're going there early, but uh, maybe we'll get to run some resources while we're there. 400 meters. Oh, hello. That's not the island, is it? I have the island marked, don't I? Uh, wreckage. I thought I had a marker for the island. 
Oh, it's over. Oh, wow. No, this is this is a different landmass. Cool. All right. What do we got over here? Doesn't seem to be a whole lot so far. Detecting massive energy signature in the region. Cannot identify. Well, that's uh, that's comforting. Okay, here's the oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, okay. Oh, ow, my god. Jesus. I gotta stop doing that. Okay, yeah, definitely gotta watch myself when exiting this Oh, what's this? Alright, stop fully before we get out, before I murder myself here. Cyclops engine fragment. Neat. Okay, what the hell is going on here? Whoa. Hey, have we seen this before? That was in the island, wasn't it? Okay, so we already learned that. Force field control? No, I don't got a tablet. All right, I guess we're gonna look around. Uh, so we have about 34 minutes to kill, which is gonna uh, probably make our recording run a bit long. Ooh, can I scan that? No, all right. Oh, hey. Uh, purple tablet. Oh. Ooh, fancy. All right, does that mean we can get into the force field? Oh, don't mind if I do. Let's take a look. Oh, let's try not to kill ourselves here. Still wounded from my Seamoth uh, doming. Insert tablet. Here you go. One tablet. Okay. Yeah, this this seems important. Indicate this structure is composed of a metal alloy with unprecedented integrity. No match is found in database. Performing structural analysis. Can I make my sea moth out of this stuff? Because uh, yeah, that thing's got that thing's made a made of glass apparently. Well, what is going on here? Well, definitely will try to scan like everything. Okay, looks like a similar. Uh, Characters on the tablet. What's this? Uh, data terminal. Unknown language. Attempting translation. Okay. Attempting translation. I thought you were going to read me something. Uh, what was that? Um, alien data. Okay. Terminal data. Alien data terminal. Discovered inside an alien facility is not possible to translate any useful information. However, the scans have returned some information on the device itself. Solid state computer, uh, low frequency radio wave, uh, alien species designed this technology, um, or genetic or colon. It's, like, it's likely that alien species which designed this technology evolved or genetically selected sensory apparatus to hear and understand this information by being or being broadcast by this device and to communicate back. This mental processing power requires the kind of telepathy that would imply the designers were considerably more psychologically developed. Physiologically? Hold on. Psychologically developed than the most common human. Further research required. Okay, lots. Well, some telepathic aliens. That's all I need right now. Okay, we got something down here. It's like a slimy thing. What is this? Ion cube. Oh. Wait, can we scan that? I should have scanned that. Um, ion cube. High, uh, high capacity alien energy source. I assume that's going to be important. Alright, let's keep moving. Alright, we're coming up on another... Oh, ion cube. Can I scan it now? Pick up ion cube. There we go, Ion Cube. Uh, ion Cube mineral, mineral substance has no entry on the periodic table, presented unprecedented ability to store huge amounts of ionic energy. Likely grown artificially, cut from a larger deposit. Uh, cubes equivalent to 5 kiloton of TNT, nice. Uh, should be released in controlled manner. Likely used as batteries. Uh, okay, assessment, valuable energy source. Cool, can we make more of those? Wouldn't mind having some more of those. Okay, looks like you have another root. Oh, okay, I can do that. And a bit of water. 
Cool. All topped off. What does this, what does this say? Unknown language. Attempting translation. Okay. Enhor enforce wait. Enforcement platform schematic. A multidimensional schematic of some kind. Um, constructed something like Shahard. We know that. It's powered by a separate self-sustaining power plant elsewhere on the planet. Uh, uses the planet's geothermal energy. Uh, engineering section. Consists of the upper engineering section where this is found. So that's where I am. The upper engineering section. And the control room, which is accessed by a separate... Uh, or sorry, sealed security elevator shaft or a separate underwater moon pool. All right. Uh, the control room in the lower section houses the only known way to interface with the facility. The schematic does not detail the operation procedure. Okay. So this is a an enforcement platform. Sounds uh, sounds sounds mildly threatening. Your best probability of interfacing with this facility is achieved by accessing the control room in the lower section. Whoa, whoa. Oh boy. Okay, I assume this is all under control. We're okay. Oh, that was a trip. Ooh, I want to get one of those for my place. Uh, oh, here, oh, here's uh, the moon pool they're talking about. Cool. Cool. Yeah, that, that leads, looks like it leads outside. Alright, nothing down there, from the looks of it. Alright, trucking on. Oh, what's this? Alien rifle. Ooh, can I take this? Scanning. Can we make it or something? Uh, alien rifle. Uh, strong resemblance to human weaponry. Um, humanoid. No obvious way to remove the rifle from the case. Maybe. Yeah, I didn't think so. Alright, let's keep moving on here. Oh, another ion cube. I guess I'm just collecting these things, aren't I? Look at that. Got a bunch of them. Cool. Oh, this looks important. What is this? Alien arch. Oh, hello. Alien arch. Okay. Uh, intended purpose is unclear. Theories on function, ceremonial, religious role, ceremonial or religious role, industrial applications, advanced teleportation network or transportation network. I mean, that's kind of a stretch, but yeah, this definitely looks like a portal. Like I'd go through it and start fighting some red orcs or something. Huh. Um, is this it? I don't see any way to interface with this thing. I, uh, well, it says further research required, so I assume can't do anything with this right now. Boop. That's freaked me out. All right, moving on. Oh, I guess I missed a staircase up here. Okay, so that was a side room. Would you just want me to look at look at that? Can't do any, anything with it. Uh, ooh, is that a... Yeah, another purple tablet. I assume you're needed. Yoink. Oh, another thing. Alien... Oh. Alien device. Doomsday device? Um, scans indicate this device contains enough potential energy to destroy the entire planet, along with most of the solar system. Fortunately, it has malfunctioned. It looks angry. Yeah, I don't know how an inanimate object can seem angry, but that seems angry. Oh, hello. Force field. So I assume we need the tablet for this. Scans indicate the facility's control room lies beyond this doorway. Okay. Sounds like, uh, sounds good to me. Take a tablet. All right. We're in. Make sure that's faded away. Just turn into some sort of a green goo or something. Okay. I feel like I don't want to miss anything here. Ah, this looks important. Um, just want to look down the sides and make sure I'm not missing something. Nothing? Nothing. Okay, what's all this about? Do those things move? Oh, yeah. Okay, it responds to my presence. That's not comforting. Interact. 
energy core. Uh, wait. There we go. Energy core. Uh, devices equivalent to 100 uh, MT, nuclear detonation. Megaton. 100 megaton nuclear detonation. Everything's just like boom. Wow. Uh, which can be channeled through the facility and directed at vessels overhead. Uh oh. Uh, or bent around the planet's gravitational pull to strike targets in orbit. That doesn't sound good for our, uh, our sunbeam that's arriving in 24 minutes. Powers read via the attached terminal allow for the device to be deactivated if necessary. We'll also do that. Uh, it's currently op operating without parameters, suggesting it will target any ship within range. So, is that an off button? It looks green to me. I mean, yes, everything's kind of green. But, uh, okay, let's, let's do this, I guess. Boop! No, wait. Um, hi. Ow, you motherfucker! Ah, that's, don't consent. You just check my glucose level. The control panel is broadcasting a message. Translation reads: Warning: Infected individuals may not disable oh. the weapon. This planet is under quarantine. Uh. This can complete. Bacterial infection in your system is progressing, detecting skin irritation and immune system response. Further data required to identify bacterial strain. Huh. Translating background broadcast. Downloading summary to databank. Okay. Um, hold on. Where'd that information go? Prawn suit. Power. Where did I just... Uh, equipment. Wait, where's the... What just went to my PDA? Something alien related. Oh, Colts and Clues. Alien facility locations. Uh, oh, I cannot read that with that green screen thing there. Intercepted background data uh, regarding further alien facilities elsewhere on the planet. A disease research facility, 800 meters deep. That's specific. Cave system with extensive fossil records southwest of the enforcement platform. So southwest of here, 800 meters deep. Uh, function, live specimen study. Objective, synthesis yeah, synthesis of antidote for highly infectious bacterium designated CARA. Wait, wait, isn't that that, um, that noble dude? So... That that's where I get cured. Can I? I don't suppose I can get there in twenty minutes and back, can I? Um, okay, thermal power facility. It's uh, generate all energy for all local facilities. So data corrupted, it get corrupted. So it's not telling us where everything is. Corner procedures will be automatically enforced in the immediate effect. Uh, Eight hundred. Okay, so southwest of the enforcement platform, cave system with a extensive fossil record. So, am I supposed to go there within 20 minutes and become cured and come back here? Because that's... That sounds a bit unlikely. Um, Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Alright, running our ass out of here. Now, um, here's the problem. I can't access that disease facility. Uh, because I can only go 300 meters deep. That's 800 meters deep. So, am I just supposed to watch watch this happen? That's cruel. Uh, what are you, the hell are you supposed to do? Uh, I'm going to look around this island just a little bit more, see, see if there's anything that's not obvious that I should be doing. Because as uh, far as I can tell, in 20 minutes, there's going to be something unfortunate happening. Oh, well, you can see the uh, the um, aurora from here. So there's a seems like a path leading up around here and up from the beach. What's this? Just uh, some salt? I'll grab some salt. Anything down here I should be seeing? No? Okay, well, I'm gonna follow this path. Okay, it's more alien stuff. It looks like a cable running from here and then down into the ground. So that's probably going off where that off-site thermal area, wherever the hell it's going off to. Ooh, there's not just shale around here. I guess I'll grab it since I'm here. I have a feeling I won't be able to do much else. Um, yeah. Ow, you prick. Yeah. Can't really... I guess I could knife you to death. Okay, there's more of those cables. I feel lots of lithium around here. Oh. Hey, it looks like a... Kind of like that arch that I found down there. Are they like connected or something? Hold on. Let me just grab... Ooh, diamonds. I actually needed these. 
Lots of diamonds. Wow, I've some good resources here. I should probably stay focused. Oh, no. Come here and get some, get some shank, you mother. All right, that'll teach you. Oh, wait, I don't have my propulsion gun thingy. Uh, let's try that. Number four. I guess I don't see any others. So what's going on here? Insert ion cube. Oh, oh, was that what this is for? Here we go. I got, uh, I got a few to spare. Whoa, yes. Yeah. Okay, I like that. Let's take a screenshot of that. Boop. Save the PDA. So there's my uh, nice. It's a good photo. Um, I'm gonna take a quick glance around here before I jump into any glowing walls. I want to make sure that er, I have everything here I need. Okay, I don't think there's anything else here. So, I mean, we have 17 minutes before the uh, the sunbeam arrives. I I hope that whatever this is is two way. Just gonna just gonna stargate through here. Oh, here it goes. Oh. Okay. Um, where the hell are we? Rendezvous, Aurora Rendezvous Point, dry land, 61 meters. So we're not f far away. Okay, what's, where are we? Let's take a look, quick look around. We're running low in time. Wait, that's a different angle of the ship. Uh, wreckage. Aurora Rendezvous Point, dry land, 84 meters. Wreckage. Did I change locations? Oh, no way. Is this the island? I think this is the island. Yeah, the most definitely the island. Yeah, this is the... Uh, yeah, that little farm thing I scanned a little while, a while back. I've actually been meaning to come back here. Because I didn't do this. I had to look it up. How the hell you get the multi-purpose room? Apparently it's right here in front of me. I didn't think to scan it. Like the whole ass building. So, cool. At least we got that. And I guess I could just pick this up. No, I didn't know that either at the time. Did it, what else did I miss here? I know I probably shouldn't be too worried about it considering the ticking clock, but what the hell, I'm right here. Oh, was I not in here? Uh, yeah, there's a PD I didn't get. Battery. Oh, I, okay, I, only way I could got in there through was through the... Uh... No, I got that. Weird I didn't get this. Integrating new PDA. Well, let's hear it. Son, I said wait for the storm to pass. Your life's more valuable to me than a plant patch. You stop being in charge when the ship you were captaining sunk. I'll stop being in charge when you take charge of yourself. Say, Chief. Chief. What? You know how to drain those grow beds of 40 tons of storm water? Or how to conjure food from the air? I know how to prioritize. I'm just saying, if that's so, What's your boy's life worth to you today? If tomorrow you're gonna be so hungry you start wondering what it tastes like, let him go deal with the plants. Son, go deal with the plants. Bard, Torgo has disembarked the habitat. Interfere with my family again, and when rescue arrives, I will leave you here. Do you understand me? No rescue coming, Chief. Not in time. No staying here, neither. This rain keeps falling. Sooner or later, this place will be buried. The only choice we got is whether to get buried with it. Well, those people didn't sound like they got along at all. Jeez. Uh, all right, so I'm heading back to the portal. Uh, we got something happening in 12 minutes, and I intend on being there. But hey, this is really really convenient. I wanted to come back here and get check those things. And uh, lo and behold, we did. So let's go, back, go ahead and check the, the more of that mountain, see if there's anything else. Maybe another portal, who knows? But we got 12 minutes, we may as well make use of it. All right, let's try this propulsion thing. Oh, um. Whoa! <laughs> yeah, you know what? I'm a fan. Get fucked. <laughs> oh, that was delightful. Um, where have you been all my life? Oh, another tablet? Really? OK, 
Okay. Uh, let's get my, uh, oh, I can't see a thing with this. Hopefully it kills him at the same time. Um, hope this doesn't take us too far away, because uh, I got I numbers to be in 10 minutes. What's over here? Uh, no, 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 no touchy. Where am I going? I feel like these tunnels are kind of intertwining and not really taking me anywhere. Oh, whoa, whoa, that's, um, that's a bit of a drop. Okay, so don't go that way. Okay, eight minutes. I probably should head back to uh, the meeting spot and um, watch helplessly, I think. I th I'm uh, going to make an assumption of what's going to happen here. All right, so back at the beach. And yeah, the meeting site's way over here. Gosh, um, I don't know if I did something wrong or if this is all scripted and this was supposed to happen. But I guess I'm just going to wait right here. Well, this tree is really nice. I just sat here and ate a bunch of the uh, tree samples, and it's really good for food and water. I mean, it takes up a lot of inventory space, but if you had it like right in front of you, you just kind of smack it a few times and eat it, and you're good to go. So it says I can plant my own, so I, I may have to look into that. All right, looks like we have an under a minute before the uh, sunbeam is due to arrive. So I guess we just wait here. Oh, didn't really notice that. Look at that. That's pretty cool. Look at the sun behind that. Huh. So, what are we waiting for? Uh oh. Something's happening. Oh, that doesn't look friendly. No, that looks like a big-ass uh, big rifle. Yep, that's a, that's a fucking turret. Look at that. That's terrifying. Look at the size of that thing. I wonder if I can run up that. Like, oh, that's... That's ominous. Uh, Sunbeam, run! No! Survivor, we see you. Man, I don't know how you held out down there. We broke an atmosphere, and we're descending towards the landing site. Um, Is that a building down there? Uh, dude, turn around. What do you mean you can't identify it? It's not good. Let's get Edel. Hold on. There's no turning back now. You sure, you sure the rest? Just go that way. Touching down at 10, 9, um, 8. Dodge. Roll. Do a barrel roll. It's coming from the building? Oh, no. Change course. Set no. No. Oh, that sucks. Oh, no. Ah. Oh. So, um... So you think someone survived? Friends? Friends? <sighs> you don't have any friends. There's, there's no friends up there. That was terrifying. Oh, uh, that's, that's just gutting. Like, you know... Someone you can finally talk to and fly away with, and it just fucking guns them down. I want to go home. Oh, what? I'm going to go to my watery home and try to invent some alcohol so I can drink away what I just saw. Welcome aboard, Captain. Well, at least they can't build me full of these fucking diamonds. Because, <laughs> uh, yeah. It's like a transformer. Look at that thing. It's cool. Okay, well, I'm going home. Anyways, uh, I'm, I've been recording for a while now, so I'm just going to stop right about here. I'm going to go home and collect my thoughts. Oh, hold on. I saw something down there. Yeah, what is that? Ooh, is that another uh, Cyclops engine fragment? Yeah, it is. Oh, we can make a Cyclops! I know uh, it's a little insensitive to be happy right now, because I saw uh, just a bunch of people die just now, like a, a bunch. Like, I don't even know how many, but a bunch, like, yeah, a bunch. Um, what's under here? Okay, I'm getting, I'm getting distracted. I need to, I need to go, I need to end the video, and... Yeah, I need, to, I need to think about something else for a while, because that was awful. Anyways, this has been Genosis with episode 8 of Subnautica. If you like what we saw here today, like the video. If you'd like to see some more in the future, consider subscribing if you haven't already. Alright, thanks for watching, and we'll see you tomorrow, where we may murder other helpless people. 
trying to, just trying to help. 